Ilphonic just wrapped up their preview stream for the upcoming Ghostbusters Spirits Unleashed Fall Update, and yes, it's official, we are getting the Scaleri Brothers. But not only are we getting Tony and Nunzio, also announced on this stream was an upcoming Necro Possessor Twitch drop, we got new images of the Zedmore gear shells, as well as a long list of balance and gameplay changes. But if you don't mind, I'm going to swerve right back into the headlining attraction, the Scalaris. And likely, I could spend the next couple minutes, couple hours, gushing about how good they look in-game. But we've got to talk about details, and both Tony and Nunzio, they're going to be part of a Hellspawn bounty, where players are going to be tasked with trapping both at the SCY County Courthouse map. Yeah, you're going to have double trouble on your hands, hopefully you're fast and they be slow, and you trap two in the box, because if you do so, you're going to unlock both of them for in-game use. There were some questions beforehand regarding how each of these characters they were going to play. Were they going to be pretty much identical, or were they going to be a new class type? Well, Tony is a poltergeist variant equipped with Toxie's shock pillar attack, while the Rotun Nunzio is an ectoplast variant featuring Slimer's noxious belch. As part of the Scaleri Brothers reveal, a sneak peek, a teaser, it was released, which we're going to play for you right now in its entirety. Next up, we have got the Zedmore gear shells offering a sleek and refined version of the Proton Pack and Particle Thrower. Like previous shells, to unlock these, players are going to have to complete in-game research contracts. And I know we posted a video of these packs here on the channel the other day, but I'm quite curious, what do you think of them? Like them? Love them? Hate them? Maybe you were so-so when you first saw them, but now a couple days later, you dig them? Yeah, comment down below, let us know. After that, there's going to be some Twitch drops, and players, they can unlock the new Necro Possessor. But not only that, previously available skins, including the Necro Plas, the Necro Basher, and the Necro Ghouli, will also be available to unlock. When it comes to this drop, it's going to start on October 21st and run through November 4th. Now, surprisingly, while I think the majority of people, they tuned in to the live stream to see the reveal of the Scaleri Brothers, most of it was dedicated, focused on extensive gameplay and balance changes. And while Ilphonic is expected to release a complete list of these changes, these alterations very soon, we've kind of compiled uh, some of the more noteworthy ones. And rather than me talking your head off here, here they are on screen just scrolling through. Obviously pause if need be, or check out this full list over on GhostbustersNews.com, a link is down below in the description. And if not evident, the release of the patch and related content uh, it seems somewhat staggered. Again, the Twitch drops, they're kicking off on October 21st, while the Zedmore gear shells, they've been listed for the 29th. No exact date for the Scaleri Brothers has been provided beyond coming soon, but we'll continue to monitor updates with more news expected shortly, so certainly keep posted to GhostbustersNews.com and right here to our YouTube channel. With that said, that's all I've got for you for this one. As always, subscribe. If you'd like to join up with Ghostbusters News, check out our Patreon page. A link to that is also in the description, and we'll see you right back here next time.